BTS made their long-awaited Korean comeback last year, just in time for their ninth anniversary. For the special occasion, the group released three new songs along with a three-CD anthology album, Proof. After releasing their three new songs, armies were eager to see the choreography for Run BTS, a song reminiscent of the group's earlier promotions and concepts. After four long months, BTS finally debuted their Run BTS choreography, and they blew fans away with their high-energy moves and their famous synchronicity. The group debuted the choreography at their yet-to-come in Busan concert in October 2022, which was performed to over 50,000 people at the Busan Asia Main Stadium, not counting the thousands of people watching screens set up outside the stadium and the incredible almost 50 million people who live-streamed the concert from home. To date, that has been the only live performance of the song as Jin joined the military in December 2022, and J-Hope followed in April 2023. Armies luckily have an official dance practice video of the song and an official video from the yet to come in Busan when they want to relieve the legendary choreography. While Armies have overwhelmingly loved the performance, Suga recently revealed that it almost didn't happen. For Suga's solo promotions, he partnered with Apple Music to bring his Suga August D radio show to life. In his final episode, released on May 16, Suga revealed that the group was originally going to just go on stage and sing Run BTS. After seeing the choreography created for the song, though, they fell in love with it, and the members changed their minds bringing the iconic stage to life. It's hard to imagine the song without its signature choreography, but thankfully armies don't have to.